are at Delaware, Michigan, looking at an ancient mining pit. Starting around 7,000 years ago, a group of early Native Americans called the Copper Culture inhabited this region. And they would use the Native Copper deposits initially to make tools like fish hooks and axes, and later on they would make ornamental objects like beads from Native Copper that they extracted here. Now, they used what's called float copper, which is pieces of copper that the glaciers picked up and then left scattered around, but they would also extract copper out of the solid rocks. They would do this using hammer stones, which are exactly what they sound like, big stones used to beat on these rocks and break the copper out, but they would also use a process called fire setting, where they would build a big roaring fire on the rocks and then dump cold water on that to cool the rocks and this heating and cooling would break and soften the rocks so it was easier to pull the copper out. Now the uh, copper culture Native Americans would then shape the copper into their beads or tools through hammering and they were not able to heat up the copper enough to smelt it, to actually melt it, but they were able to heat it enough to create what's called annealing. And we know that because annealing limits the stress fractures in the artifacts and makes them stronger tools. And all of this was happening right here where these copper culture Native Americans hollowed out this area looking for that metal.